Hello everybody, welcome back, welcome back to Sky Factory 2 Wild Trekker here and welcome to another episode. We've got a few things planned for today so we're going to get straight into those things and you may see my little lava tower here has changed. Um, we should get our super suit on first, make sure we can fly around. Yeah, so um, I've taken out all the barrels from here which had all the cobblestone on basically they're all now going into this deep storage and we've got 476,000 items at the moment so uh, yeah filling it nicely as we progress and I just kind of I like the, this this never never brick and yeah kind of kept the uh, red there or the orange for the lava and the blue for the water so I think it looks kind of good so um, yeah, I just wanted to keep that as it was. Uh, what else are we up to? So we are planning a build here. Um, I came across this in the pack, which is reinforced obsidian, and it says it's wither-proof. So uh, I want to test that theory out. So what I'm doing is building myself a chamber, which is going to take a lot of this stuff because um, it's kind of 9 by 9 by 9 but yeah so it's going to take a lot it's going to take a while to build not going to get it finished today but um, it needs a lot of this dark steel so I'm basically making a load of that up and uh, yeah we'll have that uh, we'll have that uh, going and seeing how it goes I've got rid of the blazes out there they're just far too noisy um, what else have we been up to I think that's probably at the moment I'm going to make a um, proper sort of potion area over here and by that I, I kind of a potion shop style thing so um, I'm not quite sure what style I'm going to do it in yet but we're getting a lot of these from the bags now so I figured it'd be nice just to have some shelves of potions and a little room where you can go in and sort of uh, be amazed by all the bottles uh, yeah so we'll, we'll have a go at that but the other thing we need to do um, check our book and I've moved this around a little bit so in here um where did we finish last time uh we hatched uh, da, da, da. connect the system wirelessly so we we did that and that's the only thing i haven't done but we went to the end uh what we need to do is get to the deep dark that's one of the things on the agenda and to do that we need to activate this uh sigil sigil however you want to pronounce it. Um, so I've set up an area over here. It looks a bit like a boxing ring, but as you can see, it's completely... Um, yeah, when it's going to get dark, this thing is going to get active, and it's getting dark now. Um, so we'll probably stay over here now, so we don't get any mob spawning here. But if we come down and right-click on here, you can see there it says uh, the altar has a redstone circle. Altar and circle is placed on dirt. Altar can see the moon. Um, altar has sufficient natural earth, uh, but there's two problems. Altar must not be lit outside by outside sources, which currently is because it's light and it's too early. Um, so what we are going to do, we have a cow. We are going to place the cow on here at midnight. So uh, it's getting towards night at the moment, 1841, 42. So I think anywhere within about half an hour either side of midnight, technically. So we're going to place a cow on there, sacrifice it. We're going to shift right click this onto the altar and that's going to activate it. Now, the problem is when we do this, a lot of bad mobs are going to be born or spawned in this area because it's going to change the dirt into some kind of scorched earth or something I don't know um, so we are then just gonna get out of there as quickly as possible so we are literally gonna fly straight up and get out of there and I've kind of put these blocks in here because what I'm hoping to do is once I'm out of there I can vein miner these blocks and hopefully it will get the rest as well so um, we shall see. I've never done this before. I've got my bow with me as well, just in case. Uh, everything else is gone. So, yeah, I kind of hope it's going to work. Uh, let's just check the light is now okay. Altar is in darkness. It is indeed. But I think if we put um, lights up here, it's no good. I think there is a trick about putting lights high enough that this area is... In darkness but it's not enough to spawn mobs I don't know but um, yeah certainly uh, the way we've got it here 
it's uh, it's going to be. So I think all we need to do now is wait for another few minutes to get that to darkness, and then we'll do this thing, he says, hopefully. So come back and join me then. Okay, the time is right. We're going to do this. Let's um, shift that onto there. Kill the cow. Uh, shift, right click. Get out of there. It's active. Um, and the mobs are spawning. And that's one of the things, creepers, you see. That's what I didn't want. Um, <laughs> I was so nervous doing that. It was unbelievable. But these mobs are supposedly super mobs. So they are much stronger than normal. But I'm actually surprised there's not that many. Uh, I thought there was going to be a few more than that. Let's um, see if we can get rid of this. Uh, what do they call it? It's cursed earth. So let's vein miner it. That's good, good. So, nothing else should now uh, spawn in there, but look at that Enderman. I mean, he's like super strong or something. I don't know what. Uh, let's get some lights in here. Um, have we got any torches? Uh, redstone torches, normal lights. There we go. Last thing I want to do is leave this thing unlit. So, we're going to do that, do that, do that and do that and we've got this enderman here is he just like super strong hey dude what are you enderman hey not that strong are you right um we've got everything we need did we get anything else not really so the next thing we're going to need to do let's get down here is we need to get ready to make the portal now um if we look into uh, okay uh, is it a dark deep or is it a deep dark I can never remember deep dark there we go so we've got to make this portal so that requires um quadruple compressed cobblestone four of and quintuple compressed cobblestone which is even more um now we have got some compressed cobblestone so let's just have a look um at this so we've got triple and and i think if we do that we get quadruple one of so we've got to get a load i was just playing around with this really to see what uh what we could get so um that's triple quadruple triple uh so we need a lot of that so um if we get cobblestone and this is where it goes so cobblestone makes into compressed cobblestone okay so we make a load of that and then compressed cobblestone makes into double so we'll get a load of that and then double we haven't got enough of unless we've got another load here quadruple compressed triple compressed compressed we need some more okay so uh yeah it's just really multiplying it up um compressing it all um as it were so uh we've got some double in there there we go so i'm going to go and just make all this cobblestone up because we have got loads and when i've got enough for that we will uh, come back okay I think we are ready to go so let's just remind ourselves I kind of got the recipes laid out here um, but essentially we have the quadruple and the quintuple plus the unstable ingots the unstable ingots are basically made with the iron at the top and it's cut by the diamond or something like that I think is that what they they say it is so anyway, uh, those three in that order, and of course we've got the uh, problem that when we make these things we've got about 10 seconds to get the recipe done, otherwise they explode and we die. So we don't really want that, that's why I've come uh, here to this part of the base, if anything gets damaged it shouldn't be too much of a problem. So, let's do this, let's not die, and are we ready? 
yeah so divide by diamond the signal is I highly unstable will explode after 10 seconds will also explode if the crafting window is closed or the ingot is thrown to the ground additionally the ingots will not stack do not craft unless ready but we are ready so let's go for this bang we got these ingots we then get those oh no the, the ah, no Please, please, please don't explode. They're going to explode. They're going to explode. I'm going to lose everything. Please do it now. No, that's wrong. Why is it not doing it? No. Oh, what happened there? Ah. Uh, double explosion. Don't tell me I've lost all that cobblestone. Uh, we don't have our jetpack anymore. Uh, let's have a look. Kind of knew that was going to happen. Uh, let's have a look now. So we've got a uh, grave. Do we have a grave? Well, we've got those, so that's good. But where's everything else? Where's my gravestone? Please tell me it's a gravestone, because that's my lovely armour. I uh, should have taken it off, really, shouldn't I? Um, where would it be? This way? No. Oh, don't tell me that's gone. Tell you what, let's get a jetpack. We've got a jetpack in here. We have. Let's go and... Uh, yeah, that's how the jetpack works. It's been so long. Um, but that's really weird because... There is no, unless it's because it's a half slab, the, um, it didn't form. So, up on top of here, perhaps? Yes, there it is. Yay. <laughs> uh, so worried then there was no, uh, right, how are we going to do this? Uh, tell you what, we are going to go and get some cobble. Let me go and get that, get my stuff back, and then we'll see what we are missing. And we'll try this again. Hopefully everything I need is in there. I was worried about these, because, um, yeah, they were a bit uh, a bit more precious, if you like, because they took a lot of these to actually uh, craft them. Jetpack's good. Just want to put a bit of a safety net around here. Uh, so we'll put that a bit lower. Yeah, a bit lower. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. Now we should be able to get this. Good. Okay, so we got our armor. We still got that. That's good. So the only thing we lost um, is the iron and diamonds. Well, the, the unstable ingots, I guess. So, yeah. Not bad. Right, let's go and get some more. Whoa! I've got jetpack on. <laughs> forget, forget which mode you're in. Uh, right, let's go. That would have been disastrous, wouldn't it? Falling off at this particular point. So we need four more diamonds. Um, one, two, three, four. And we need four more iron. Where's our iron? Two, three, four. There we go. Right, okay. Uh, shall we try this again? I just really, really weird why that didn't um, do it as I thought. But what I'm going to do... Um, so we need... All right, that is it. Let's double check the recipe. So, uh, deep, dark. Yeah, so we're making those left and right. And then the rest are in the corners. Well, let's do this again then. So diamonds at the bottom. Those there. So are we ready? Take two. Right. One, two, three. Oops, four. These round the outside. That one in the middle. Boom. Yay. <laughs> oh, what a relief. What a relief. Ah. Uh, Oh well, it's uh, it's good fun to try these things. So we never really um, tried this one myself before, so uh, I don't know why I'm doing that. I've got one of these. Let's get rid of that out there. Cool. Okay. Now we've got to worry about where we're going to put this. And I guess this is kind of our portal area. Um, so we ought to. 
put it here really shouldn't we this is our way into portals so um, put it there I guess we can always cover the ceiling up and mm, that doesn't look so good does it uh, I presume we can pick it up we can so let's let's put it down the bottom then let's uh, see what we've got down here so that's that area there yeah let's put it here in the middle of where we're going to be doing that bit there so it'll be like a division cool okay so that's done so what we now need to do is just prep ourselves to go over there so what I'm gonna do is make a load of torches which we don't really have um, yeah so I'm gonna do that let me get prepared and we'll come back right let's do it let's head it into uh, the deep dark. Uh, all I've got is a load of torches, a little bit of food. Uh, probably don't even need my wireless terminal, but we've got it anyway because that isn't going to work. <laughs> yeah, um, let's do this. I guess. <clears throat> excuse me. Hopefully the game does not crash, and because there's always problems with these things loading into new terrains. Well, let's see. Load for me. Now I've never been here. I've seen it once or twice, and as far as I know, as you can see on there, um, it's just a very dark place, um, which, if we head down here, at some point should, because uh, I think we're towards the top, 148, we should come into uh, a big area. Now, there's a lot of smooth stone here. It's almost dark out there. Let's keep lighting it up. Should have just straight ahead and seen if that makes any difference. It's going down quite a way. Let's just keep on going, see what we find. Aha, more cobblestone. A deep void. Aha. So let's take a sneak over. So, uh, yeah, so we got our. Uh, the Didn't like that. Ooh. Okay, let's just light this up a bit. Where are we? So I guess. Right, we need to mark this, don't we? Um, so that's where we are going to go. Let's just make this a little bit easier for getting up into, which I guess is going to be something like that. There we go. And then we'll light this up with a few torches to signify that this is where it is. Yeah, okay. So it is very, very dark. I don't know what you guys can see, but I can see looks like spawners is that spawners over there it's very very dark now would a potion help yeah some flashing lights over there I'm kinda of gonna go down let's have a look and see what this is it just oh What is that a cloud we're in or something like that? Yeah. Cobblestone. Massive place. But uh, very, very dark. It looks like that is possibly ground down there and there are mobs spawning. There's more cobblestone here just hanging from these pillars okay what I think I'm gonna do is let's we've got night vision potions let's go and see if that makes a difference or not so uh, let me go and grab those and I'll be right back right let's see what this does aha <laughs> much better wow look at that that's amazing 
Look at that terrain. Look at that tower in the middle. It's almost like, in fact, there's several of them. It's like the big supports to the roof. Which, yeah, it's very much like the um, the ones you get on the ice bikes biomes. I presume, is it hollow or is it just solid all the way through? Yeah, solid all the way through. Um, so that's ours up there in the middle, but I presume we can easily get lost. Um, so we probably ought to find some way of marking this. In fact, let's just go and get our coordinates, I guess. Um, yeah, about 200, 100. That's about, oh no, uh, sorry. 200, 250, something like that. 200, yeah. Whoa, what's happening? Ah, is it because it's too dark? Okay, yeah. Uh, I had heard that if it gets too dark, um, then also that has an effect on you as well. So uh, luckily I've got these canisters. I've got 10 normal ones, only one yellow canister unfortunately, but that's given us all the orange and one yellow thing there. So, um, okay, so the only thing that we don't have, and the map's not really working on here, but I guess that's possibly because um, we can't see anything. So uh, let's go down to ground level see if we can't place a torch or two for these things uh... oh, come on back up again but that doesn't make any difference to that whatsoever okay so we'll use a longer potion now I wasn't quite sure if it was uh... good before or not so uh... right so let's just head in this direction quickly and we'll use some torches up high to um, kind of stop us going mad in the dark I think is the oh what's that over there okay so we now have a temple okay let's go and have a look at this it's cut through one of those structures there isn't it so um, pretty cool I'm not gonna go in there today um, because I know it's just gonna be full of mobs I'm sure there's chests and things like that um, but that's for another day so what I do want to do though is work out which way back it is was it over this way and then this way <laughs> lost already um, let's have a look 250 that's about right back down to 200 yeah so it's back this way. Okay, so that's pretty good. Let's um, whoa, let's get a torch up. It's like being underwater, isn't it? You got to put a torch up. That's um, to get some breathing. We said about 200, didn't we? So it's going to carry on this way a bit. I think we're going to have to put a row of torches on the ground. There we go. Cool. Okay, so we are back here now. The other thing I want to know is. Right, how long have we got? Two minutes in night vision. Um, what I want to know is this. What's that over there? Sorry, I was looking over there and it looks slightly different. Um, all this cobblestone. Well, that's interesting. What is that? Oh, yes. That's what I wanted to know. And there's my answer. As you can see down there, lots of ores. So, um, lots of ores means setting up a quarry. So I think that's something we are going to do here, is uh, come back, make an area safe. And what's this? That's very bizarre. It's like, it's made out of, whoa, it's a chest. Okay, put a torch there. Is it going to do anything to me? Can I open it? No. How bizarre. So what's... um? Can we break it? Is it going to kill us if we do? It's not a trap chest. It's gone. Okay, someone want to tell me what that is? 
I'd appreciate it. Very bizarre structure, that's for sure. Um, interesting place. Definitely one for night vision potions. Um, stuff is appearing on the map now, I guess because we're further on down. That's where we went to the other place. Right, okay. Night vision potion going. How long do we have on this one? That's six minutes. That's three minutes. Let's have a look at it when the lights go out. I can see you down there. And it's probably quite good without the night vision potion on to find your way back because that's um, that's always the tricky thing, isn't it? Getting in these places and being completely lost like a maze. And there we go. It's very dark. What did I just get there? Redstone. The chest. Okay, diamonds, all that. Was that all in the chest? Is it just lagging? Who knows? Right, I'm going to take the three minute one because what I'm going to do is head back, I think, which I think is this way. Uh, four, five, one. Yeah, that's going down. Uh, in fact, it probably means it's, oh, I don't know. This way somewhere. Right, yeah, so there's that um, hole we found. So we're not far from that. So I think this way a little bit more. And looks like up here. Cool. Okay, we found it. Certainly somewhere we're going to have to come back and uh, explore, but not today. I think we've had enough adventures today. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, so uh, I think think that is probably where we're going to end it so um yeah hopefully you guys have enjoyed the episode um it's been a fun one to make it's nice to do some challenges i haven't done before so that's always good so let's take this armor off now we're in the safety of our base cool okay well join me next time here on sky factory i'm really enjoying the series that's why i've got a few of these coming out Hopefully you are too. Certainly uh, it appears to be by the number of people uh, watching. Please do leave a like down in a comment if you are. It means a lot to me. And we'll see you next time here on Sky Factory 2. My name's Wild Tracker and bye for now.